So today I'm flying from Düsseldorf to Doha, from Doha to Bangkok with Qatar Airlines, which is supposed to be the best in everything. So let's see how economy is. At the check-in there were two possibilities to get in, the normal check-in and the web. Uh, check-in. However, when I checked in with WEP, it had like um, a confirmation parts, not really a ticket. Uh, maybe that's a new trend in aviation that they just give you confirmation parts because otherwise you have, still have to do kind of a check-in anyway. Right now I'm at the international terminal, which is terminal C um, of Düsseldorf. It's a pretty small terminal, actually. They only have like three places where you can eat something. They have a few shops, of course, they have few duty-free and a lot of launches. But I'm fine with economy, so no launch for me. ended up in Doha now and I wait for my connecting flight to Bangkok. So the flight overall was pretty good, I liked it, very comfortable, uh, enough, leg, enough leg room and uh, the food was very good actually. This is bread I thought was very weird because I thought it would be cake or something, no it was bread. The only thing that confused me a little bit is that they run out of orange juice and later at the end of the flight they served me orange juice. Well that's okay. But when you fly with an high-class airline, I think you can be a little bit more critical than other flights, right? I think so. I think it's always fascinating when I fly from Germany, how small the airports are there. Even the new airport in Berlin is actually so tiny compared to this huge airport with a lot of entertainment, fun, shopping, whatever. I took the time to go to this garden and it's really amazing. I'm getting closer to it and I already feel the refreshing air. It's really cool. I'm actually now at an airport. That's very cool. The air in here is so refreshing. After six hours flight, I really needed that. I would say longer, but my flight goes about in an hour.
powering all electrical. including the washroom. Thank you. It was very comfortable, although I thought we had a flat tire. <laughs> it was like, wow, well, making a lot of noise when we landed. Compared to the first flight, it wasn't so loud actually, so the bigger air jet was way better. The main difference between those two flights was actually the entertainment. I thought, well, you on one flight with the airline and you go on the other, other one, and you might find the same movies and you can finish the one you just started. But uh, it wasn't the case. So actually on the flight from Doha to Bangkok, um, they had less movies, which I think was weird. Uh, the seat was a little bit harder uh, than the one on the first flight.
drain of water at Sultan Station. With the power of the vessel, there is a hot dog in the wheel.